boys and girls, Miss Chifo. So I have a read aloud for you today, All the Places You Will Go, by my favorite author, Dr. Seuss. I hope you enjoy it as much as I do. All the Places You Will Go. Congratulations. Today is your day. You're off to great places. You're off and away. You have brains in your head and feet in your shoes. You can steer yourself any direction you choose. You're on your own and you know what you you know what you know, and you are the guy who'll decide where you go. You look up and down streets, look them over with care, and you will say, I don't choose to go there. With your head full of brains and your shoes full of feet, you're too smart to go down any not too good street. You may not find any you'll want to go down. In that case, of course, you'll head straight out of town. It's opener there in the wide open air. And there are, things other, uh, there are things that can happen, and frequently do, to the people as brainy and footsy as you. And when things start to happen, don't worry, don't stew, just go right along, you'll start happening too. Oh, the places you will go. You'll be up on your way, you'll be seeing great sights, you'll join the high flyers who soar to high heights. You won't lag behind, because you'll have the speed, you'll pass the whole gang, you'll soon take the lead. Wherever you fly, you'll be, you'll be best of the best. Wherever you go, you'll be on top of the rest. Except when you don't, because sometimes you won't. I'm sorry to say, but deadly it's true that bang-ups and hang-ups can happen to you. You can get all hung up in a prickly perch, and you again will fly on. You'll be left in a lurch. You'll come down from the lurch for the most unpleasant bump, and the chances are then that you'll be in a slump. And when you're in a slump, you're not in for much fun. Unslumping yourself is not easily done. You will come to a place where the streets are not marked. Some windows are lighted, but most of them dark. A place you could sprain both your elbow and chin. Do you dare stay out? Do you dare go in? How much can you lose? How much can you win? And if you go in, should you turn left or right? Or right on three quarters, or maybe not quite? Or go around back and sneak in from behind? Simple it's not, I'm afraid you will find. For your mind maker upper to make up its mind. You can get so confused and you'll start to then you'll start in to race and down will wiggle roads at a breaknecking pace. And grind on for miles across British wild space, headed by fear towards a most useless place. The waiting place. For people just waiting. Waiting to go, waiting for a train to a bus to come, or a plane to go, or mail to come, or the rain to go, or the phone to ring, or the snow to snow, or waiting around for a yes or a no, or waiting for their hair to grow. Everyone is just waiting. Waiting for the fish to bite, or waiting for the wind to fly a kite, or waiting around for Friday night, or waiting perhaps for their Uncle Jake, or a pot to boil, or a better break, or a string of pearls, or a pair of pants, or a wig with pearls, or another chance. Everyone is waiting. No, that's not for you. Somehow you'll escape and waiting of all the waiting and staying and find the bright places where boom bands are playing. With banner flip flapping, one more you'll ride high, ready for anything under the sky, ready because you're that kind of guy. All the places you will go, there is fun to be done. There are points to be scored, there are games to be won, and the magical things you can do with that ball will make all the winningest winner of all fame. You'll be famous as famous can be, the whole wide world watching you win on TV. Except when they don't, because sometimes they won't. I'm afraid that sometimes you'll play lonely games too, games you can't win, because you'll play against you. All alone. Whatever you like, whenever you like it or not, Alone will be something you'll be quite a lot. And when you're alone, there's a very good chance you'll meet things that scare you right out of your pants. There are some down the road between hither and yon that can scare you so much you won't want to go on. But on you will go, through the weather, though the weather be foul, or you will go through your enemy's prowl. On you will go, through the hackens crawl prowl, onward and upward, a frightening creep, through your arms may get sore and your sneakers may leak. Oh, on and on you will hike, and now you'll hike far and face up your problems, whatever they are. 
You'll get mixed up, of course, as you already know, you'll get mixed up with many strange birds as you go. So be sure when you step, step with care and great tact. And remember that life's a great balancing act. Just never forget to be dexterous and deft, and never mix up your right foot with your left. And will you succeed? Yes, you will indeed. 98 and 3 quarters percent guaranteed. Kid, you'll move mountains. So, be your name Buxbaum or Bixie or Bray or McCordelay, Lynn, uh, Alan O'Shea. You're off to great places. Today is your day. Your mountain is waiting. So get on your way. Boys and girls, I hope that was a fun story. And just remember, all the places you will go remind you of how successful you're going to be. And you all will be. Bye.